When they returned to the mini dome, Eno checked the text transfer recorder. There's a message for you on the text transfer from Major Finnan that says urgent. Keenan went to the message transfer and pulled up the message. It read as follows. Patrolman Keenum, please come to my office as soon as possible. Major Finnan. Keenum says, I wonder what this is about. I'd better get right over. Inu said, I'm coming too. I don't want to miss out on any more of your adventures. All right, said Keenum, let's go. When they arrived at Major Finnan's office, they arrived at Major Finnan's office in record time. They went by 1004, as it was clear. They were escorted into Major Finnan's office by one of the duty patrolmen. Your message said urgent, said Keenum, so we came as fast as we could. Thank you for coming, Patrolman Keenum, said Major Finnan. Commander Finloy has been called away to Planet Flexton for a war council meeting, and he's left me in charge until his return. He then looked at Inu and hesitated for a moment, as if to say that the business at hand was for Keenum only. Keenum picked up on that and said, Whatever you have to say to me, you can say to my friend Patrolman Inu. We are inseparable. Inu felt a tinge of pride when he heard that, heard Keenan's words. As you wish, says Major Finnan. I suppose this business will affect him too. Two hour marks ago, a spaceship from the planet Glectron was on its way to planet Cloen when it developed this pro the thrust problems. It had to make an emergency landed here in Ob. It's down in spaceport two. I see, said Keenum. Major Finnan continued. It may take a few day marks to get the parts from Glickron. We have sent a request for the parts already. But here's the problem. There is a rather special passenger on board. His name is Enlightened Master Wu. Enlightened Master Wu, asked Keenan. Yes, said Finnan. He's a highly esteemed Enlightened Master from Planet Ute. He is well respected in this part of the galaxy. But how is that a problem, queried Keenum. The problem is, Master Wu, because of his enlightened thinking, has many enemies as well as admirers. Many religious sects feel threatened by his influence. The organic God believers and the electro people's God force believers among them. You understand how that is? Indeed I do, said Keenum. So what is it you would like me to do? Well, I was hoping you would take Master Wu out to your mini-dome as your guest for a few days while we repaired the spacecraft. I believe that with all the Fleck God, Flecton God-believers in the compound and the God-Force Plutons that, that could here in Central Dome, it would be best if his presence here in the dome were kept quiet. We wouldn't want any problems of a religious nature to rise. I can see your point, said Keenum. Keenum turned to Eno who gave a more or less affirmative shrug, then said to Major Finnon, uh, We would be most happy to have Master Wu as our guest. Good, said Major Finnon. I was sure I could count on you. We've managed to keep Master Wu on board the spacecraft by telling him that the repairs would only take a few hours. What you need to do is go down to Port 2, where the spacecraft is docked, and tell Master Wu that you are a pri priority patrolman, and that you would like him to be your guest. What if he doesn't want to go, as you know? He knows the authority of a priority patrolman, said Major Finnan. When Keenum shows him his priority orders, he will go. He wouldn't cause a scene. Very well, says Keenum. We will go directly to Spaceport 2 now. Thank you, said the Major. And by the way, I have made arrangements to have an organic life support package delivered to your dome. Master Wu is an organic, so he will need organic substance while he's visiting you. The support package comes with organic food and all the rest of the things organics need. Very good, Major. We're on our way. Keenum whispered to Keenum. Eno whispered to Keenum as the, on the way out. A bit presumption of the Major to anticipate our answer beforehand and order the organic package sent to our dome, don't you think? Keenum said nothing. The Glictron spacecraft was in Dock Bay 5 on the east side of Port 2. Eno pulled the module up to the loading portal so it could be lifted up to the craft's main door. I'll go back and set up the organic life support package, said Eno. I'll meet you back at the mini-dome. Good idea, said Keenum. 
Kinam signaled the duty patrol to lift the module up to the craft's door. When it stopped, he opened the door and entered to find the space entered to find the spacecraft empty. Then far in the back, in the last row, he saw a man sitting all alone. He walked back to his seat and said, By any chance, do you happen to be Master Wu? Yes, was the reply. I am Wu. My name is Patrolman Kinam from Mini Dome C. I was sent at the request of Major Finon. Wu said nothing. Kinam continued, I'm afraid that the repairs in this craft will take a little longer than has been expected. It could be as long as two days. Wu said nothing. Major Finon was thinking that perhaps you would do me the honor of staying at my dome while the craft was being repaired. Wu said nothing. My dome is on the perimeter. He felt that it would be more quiet for you out there than the central dome. Keenan was trying to fill the silence with words because he was unnerved by Master Wu's silence. The dome can be quite noisy at times. I also have a rather nice view of Obe, being so far out. His voice trailed off as he could see Master Wu was not responding. There was a few more moments of awkwardness for Keenum. Then Wu spoke. It would be my pleasure, he said. Oh, good, said Keenum, trying to hide his relief. They entered the module and lowered, and were lowered down and detached from the lift. Keenum waved to the duty patrolman who was maneuvering his model. He decided to take the perimeter route in order to avoid running into flectons who might be hanging around the transfer station at the patrol domes. He was also open to give Inu time to set up the organic life support package back at the mini dome. We'll take the perimeter route, said Keenum. It's a little more scenic. There are some portholes that you can view Ob as we go by. Wu just nodded. 